Hey everyone, Paul Hamilton here from UTB. Let's take a look at how we can add photos and images to Reality Composer. So I'll just shut down my properties and I'll swipe up from the bottom of my iPad to open up photos. If photos is not there in the swipe up, just open up photos before you get into Reality Composer. And so you can see there, I've opened it on a preview screen and I'm just gonna do a long press, long press and hold that press and drag it onto my screen. Um, and you can see there, the image comes in beautifully. I can rotate that. I can move it by the X, Y, and Z axes as well. So it can be in a split screen or it can be in a preview screen. Let's try it with Keynote and go directly from Keynote. So swipe up. And if I've opened up Keynote previously or recently, it's there. And I can drag my Keynote shapes or my Keynote drawings directly into Reality Composer. Just remember, it's a long press and you should get that little plus, the green plus pop up as you're dragging it across. And this should work with most apps. Uh, it won't work with videos or GIFs or GIFs, um, but it will work with all of your beautiful keynote drawings with Apple Pencil and any images that you've got on your camera roll. Just be aware that high resolution photos is really going to blow out your file size of Reality Composer. Paul Hamilton here from UTB. Hope that helps.